Hello, third grade scientists, and welcome back. Today, we are going to review the vocabulary for Unit 3, Habitats and Change. This week, you will be doing some review on all the lessons you've learned in this unit, and then take some assessments of your knowledge of these lessons at the end of the week. So this vocabulary review will prepare you for those assessments. This week, you will review and assess your learning in Unit 3, Habitats and Change. In this video, you will have the opportunity to assess your knowledge of the key vocabulary from this unit of study. So let's get going. Remember, we're focusing on two types of vocabulary, academic and content vocabulary. The academic vocabulary are the words that you may find in some of the questions or focuses for the lessons that you've learned throughout this unit. Remember, these words can be found in other focus questions and subject areas as well. Knowing this academic vocabulary can help you across all subjects in school. The content vocabulary words are words that are specific to understanding the science lessons. These are words that go along with the science lessons from Unit 3. Knowing these words will help you better understand the content of what you learned. Let's review the academic vocabulary from this unit. So we had three words that we focused on from this unit, from our focus questions and lessons, lesson objectives. So let's take a minute here and test your knowledge of these words. The first word was reveal. Think about whether or not you remember what the, wor what the word reveal means. Reveal means to show or uncover. So if that was your guess at the meaning of this word, then you did a great job. Reveal means to show or uncover. Remember, we used the example of a gender reveal party. How about the word evidence? Do you remember what the word evidence means or can you think of any examples? Evidence is something that gives proof or reason to believe. How did you do? Remember, we used a fingerprint as an example of a type of evidence. How about the word research? Do you remember or can you think of what the word research means? Research is the careful study of something in order to find out information about it. You did this type of work throughout the unit. You researched the information you were looking at and you gathered more information through each lesson as you were working. The content vocabulary for this unit. Let's review some of the important content words for this unit's lessons. We will look at some examples of this unit's content vocabulary. Look at the example and see if you can identify the matching vocabulary word. These are the vocabulary content words we looked at from this unit. We had the word fossil, extinct, conservation, organism, habitat, ecosystem, and adaptation. I will show you an example of the word. Try to match the word with the example and think about the meaning of the word as you're studying the examples. Take a look at this example. Which vocabulary word do you think this is an example of? If you said extinct, you are absolutely correct. Dinosaurs are an extinct species. Extinct describes a species that no longer exists or is alive on the planet. Other words that mean the same thing are obsolete or deceased. Let's look at another example. This is a picture of a forest that's been labeled as a wildlife refuge. In other words, it's being protected in order to maintain the, the species that are living there. Which word do you think matches this example? If you said conservation, you're absolutely correct. Conservation is the protection of natural resources such as soil, water, or forests from loss, pollution, or waste. 
Here you have a picture of bacteria or germs being looked at under a microscope. Which vocabulary word is this an example of? If you said organism, you are correct. An organism is any individual living thing, such as a plant, an animal, or even a germ. Here you see the, a picture of an animal skeleton that is embedded or inside of a rock. Which vocabulary word is this an example of? If you, if you said fossil, you are 100% correct. A fossil is the remains or trace of a living animal or plant from a long time ago. Fossils are found embedded in earth or rock. Here you see a picture of a community of different living organisms underneath the surface of the water. What is this picture an example of? If you said ecosystem, you would be right. An ecosystem is a community of living things together with their environment. Here you see a picture of a dolphin jumping out of his home in the ocean. Which vocabulary word would this be an example of? If you guessed habitat, you are correct. Habitat is the natural environment of an animal or plant. It is the natural home of an animal or plant. Here you see a picture of an animal who has changed its coloring to green in order to protect itself. What is this an example of? If you said an adaptation, you are correct. Adaptation is the change in an organism over time that enables it to survive and multiply. Now that you are familiar with and have tested your knowledge on these awesome words, you will be able to use them throughout your review this week and in your assessments later this week of this unit. Remember, use this video as a resource. It's an excellent studying tool. Keep re-watching the video, testing your knowledge on the words, and see if you can guess them all correctly. Good job, good luck, third grade scientists.